Hey guys, welcome back to Charlie and me, our camping vlog. As you see, we are in the B-Bot today. It's Friday, just waiting for Deirdre to finish up a bit of work. And we're heading off to Ennis Corty in County Wexford to Walsh's Field Motorhome Parking. It's a working farm and they have put in facilities, basically a field with fresh water. And I believe there's waste disposal. It's about an hour and 25 minute drive from here. The weather is to be a bit of a mixed bag this weekend. We were told it's going to be sunshine. There may be a chance of showers. Today, while I'm doing this now at five past one, it's dull, it's overcast. We had a little bit of rain this morning, but you know what? That's not going to dampen our spirits. We were to be meeting some of the camping crew, but none of them can make it. So myself, Deirdre and Charlie heading off in the Biba to Ennis Corty. So if the camera on the dash behaves, you're skipping to here to get rid of the road footage and you'll just see us coming in the gate of Walsh's farm. Okay, so skip to here, otherwise watch the bit of footage. It's not a lot of footage and it's great to see the Irish countryside. So let's head off and go get Deirdre. And next time we talk to you, we should be in Ennis Corthy. I think it's Blackwater, Ennis Corthy in County Wexford. So here's where we are. Charlie has got a, a friend has come over. Here's where we are. We came in that way there. Uh, those, they were all here bar one motorhome. This van came in just ahead of us and we're parked along here. I won't be getting the drone up because it basically is just a field. They have all these little lights on every second pillar, uh, on every second post. So it is a working farm. Now the thing is, and you won't see it from here, but there's chickens roaming around. So he's going to stay tethered, which is the rules anyway i'd say so you can see there's a caravan here there are no tents allowed but there's a caravan a couple of motorhomes it is 25 past five today that we're recording this um is the 25th of june yesterday was deirdre's birthday so she's inside relaxing for her birthday um anyway so i'll put coordinates if i can find them on this video here to where we are it's very quiet as I say, it's Blackwater in County Wexford. 
It is a working farm, bear that in mind. I'm very surprised actually that they let dogs. Now I will be honest, Charlie hasn't got a stim of sense and he'd chase the chickens if he got a chance where the other dogs don't seem to be bothered at all that are here. That motorhome actually has three dogs. That caravan has one and another motorhome. They have a dog and he's gone off with the lead in his mouth. Charlie would choke on it. <laughs> Wouldn't you, Charlie? Chaz? <laughs> but yeah, do you know what? If you just want a night away, they're putting up their awnings and they're, they're putting up their windbreakers. If you just want a night away, this is a nice place. I'll tell you more about, about it a little bit later on when we meet the people. I don't know if you can see that, but there's a chicken just walking across the green there. There he is, look. So we've come out of the campsite and it was literally a five, seven minute walk down the village. Uh, shops, there's a spa, there was a petrol station which had a good convenience store. And this is a river walk. And it reminds me, and I was only saying to Deirdre, it reminds me of Ardmore where, but look at this, they have little, I don't know if you can see that, there's a little ladder there. And there's eyes on the trees. And then there's, um, that's telling us about not weed, but there's little signs saying for the bees. And it's, it's beautiful. We just met another couple walking two dogs and one of the dogs jumped in for a drink. Now you'll see, look at those little things. That's a hubcap off a of Peugeot. Well, and look. And there's a little fairy house. This is literally, as I say, about a five or seven minute walk from Walsh's farm. Look at all these decorative. They're all just wheel, wheel trims. It's beautiful. And it's so quiet, listen. We'll just take you across this bridge and see what way the water seems to divert over that way. So let's see what's up here. There it is there. But the walk continues. So there's lambs in the field next to us and that guy on the left keeps attacking Charlie. The other guy doesn't care and Charlie doesn't care. But your man keeps attacking him. Look at him stomping. That lamb is not having any of this. He's feckin' violent. Isn't he violent, Charlie? You can see the little black guy there, doesn't care. But this fella here is giving Charlie grief. Look! A good night last night here at Walsh's Farm, Motorhome Park. Uh, this is a quiet, quiet place. There are no facilities. There's fresh water and there are bins. You can see them there at the end of the park. 
it's quiet things to do the village blackwater as you saw from the video we went for a walk down there yesterday evening and it's a beautiful walk there's a spa there's a petrol station with a shop there's a takeaway there's a pub it's a beautiful village and we were only saying it's very well kept like it's a real tidy towns entry kind of village that's the village blackwater when you go out the gates to the right is Courtown, to the left is Curraclo, and I believe to the left, only three kilometers away, is a beautiful beach. We're gonna take a trip down there after breakfast this morning, and there's a loop walk. So all in all, this is a nice stopover for one or two nights. It's 10 euro a night, as I say, fresh water. Now, we were talking to the owners and they do plan on developing it just slightly, not turning it into a campsite, but putting in gray water and black water disposal. There are picnic tables. They're gonna put in one or two more. Do you know what? It, it doesn't look very level, but it's actually a lot leveler than it looks. So, but they are talking. Now they were talking about putting in hard stands, but they said maybe, but for the moment, it's something that they do want to develop due to the popularity of it. They're kind of limiting, limiting it to 20 motorhomes, or as you can see, there's a caravan here, but 20 units. So I will give you the contact details here. They prefer if you book. Now you could kind of roll up, but they would much rather that you give them a buzz and see if there's space. So again, here's the phone number here. You will get them on Facebook under Walsh's Farm Motorhome Parking, but your best bet is to give them a buzz and book yourself, I won't say a pitch, but book yourself a bit of space in the field. So that is it for this short midweek video. It's an air, so it's not really a campsite review, but it is a place worth stopping off. And as you can see, Charlie is loving it here as well. So from me, Aaron, and from the star of the show, Charlie. Thanks for watching us. Thank you for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please do. You don't have to. Don't forget, we're available on Instagram and Twitter as well. And don't forget every Wednesday, the podcast with myself and Chris. Just search for The Camping Crew wherever you listen to your podcasts. Stay safe until we talk to you again from another campsite very, very soon. Bye-bye.